Hello, and welcome to day 17 of The Homecoming. My name is Bree. I'll be gently guiding you through this experience. Today is day 17, and we are mindful. Mindful of the changes. Mindful of our intent to be present during our practice. Today, we're gonna journey through a set of poses and then we're gonna switch directions and journey through the same set of poses. But I think you'll notice that it feels different. Even though you're doing the same thing, it just feels different. If we can go through the same set of experiences and feel different, can we show up with compassion, with understanding, with empathy to those moments where we are doing something different? when someone is different from us. Is it possible to be mindful in both situations that you're very familiar with and also in very unfamiliar ones? Today we're gonna start in mountain pose. As you come into mountain, consider this. Is it possible to be comfortable, to stand firm, to be grounded in both situations you welcome and those you have a hard time journeying through. Bring your attention to your breath. Really check in. Be mindful of your posture. Make small tweaks just to improve the quality of your posture. Make sure the crown of your head is parallel with the sky. Find a focal point in front of you. Lift your chest just a little bit higher. Make sure your weight is evenly distributed throughout the four corners of your feet. Bring your hands gently but attentively to your side and breathe. Bring your hands up overhead, having them touch at the top, fold forward, let your head hang loose, step back into plank. Hold here and then step forward with your left foot coming into low lunge. Find your balance, lift your arms to the sky, hang here. Welcome the heat. Bring your hands back down, step back, step back into plank, slowly lower through chaturanga. And then come back to plank. Bring your knees down for a quick puppy pose. Really stretch it out. Release the tension in your shoulders. Come back to plank and then step with your right foot. Come into warrior one. A white stance with your hands out to the side. Bring your hands down to the mat. and fully release your head. Slowly roll it up, one vertebrae at a time. Bring your hands up overhead and fold forward again. Bring your hands to the mat. See if you can go just a little bit deeper on the second fold. Come into flat back. Teeter totter your feet, bringing them together and ragdoll fold here. Slowly rolling it up. Hands overhead. And then down at your side. 
check in again here in Mountain Pose. Really noticing your posture. Even weight in the feet, level pelvis, crown parallel to the ceiling, hands gently but intentionally at your side. Okay, we're gonna turn to the opposite side of our mat. Checking in, one quick breath, hands up overhead, slowly fold forward, bring your hands down to the mat. Take a quick ragdoll fold and then step back into plank. Check in here, slowly lower to the ground. Come up for Chaturanga. Come back down to the mat. And then take a quick puppy pose. Breathe here, notice here. Transition back to plank. Step forward with your left foot, journeying through low lunge into warrior one. Bring your hands back down to the mat. Step back. Slowly lower down. Come up for chaturanga. Notice your back getting stronger. Come into plank. And then step forward with your right foot into warrior one. Bring your hands back down to the mat. Step back into plank. Slowly lower to the ground. Come into puppy pose. Really check in, notice your shoulders. Keep active in your feet. Then come into a seated position. Release, let it all go. Come here. Fully breathe in, fully breathe out. Notice the energy. Notice the heat. Bring your hands to your chest. Breathe here. And then to your forehead, the light in me honors the light in you. More love, more compassion. I'll see you on the mat tomorrow. Bye for now.